Mari McInerney from Croaky here at the Choosing Wisely National Meeting in Melbourne and I have Linnell here. Linnell, would you introduce yourself? Uh, my name's Linnell Cogan. I work for the ROCGP as a project officer. And what's your interest in being here today at the, the latest meeting really about Choosing Wisely principles which are to reduce unnecessary and sometimes harmful treatments? So I help out with the Choosing Wisely uh, project uh, as part of the work I do at the college. Uh, so as part of that, uh, we've uh, developed 10 recommendations so far. Um, at expert GPs have very kindly uh, done all that hard work. Um, and we're absolutely uh, keen to look at um, ways that we can reduce overtreatment um, and improving the health of our patients um, and avoiding harms where possible. Fantastic. Now those recommendations are for treatments where practitioners and patients should discuss whether or not they're really necessary, yeah? That's correct. We're absolutely um, keen for people to um, have that conversation with their GP uh, where possible and uh, so that they can work together and have that, uh, GPs can have that patient-centred approach um, to their healthcare. And what are you looking for from today? Uh, I'm looking forward to hearing about the work that everybody else is doing um, and getting to talk to people and uh, yeah, seeing all the different innovative ways that uh, people are helping to improve patient health care in Australia. Fantastic, Janelle. Thank you very much. Now moving over. And I have here Dale. Dale, could you introduce yourself, please? I'm Dale Comrie. I'm representing Chiropractic Australia. And what's your interest in being here today and what's been your involvement today in choosing um, We're a, a a slow burner. We've just recently joined on and uh, we're still going through the process of producing our five recommendations, oh, six recommendations actually. Um, so we're still in the process of uh, uh, surveying our members and coming up with the, the recommendations and developing the, the uh, script that goes with those. What's the sense of the challenges that chiropractors face, particularly in this? We're, we're a fairly much a, a youthful organisation and we're, we're still trying to integrate chiropractic more into mainstream medicine. We're, we're, um, we've had a history of being a bit of a maverick and out on our own, so it's about time we sort of developed more of an integrative approach and, and be a bit of a team player. Thanks. And what are you looking for from today? Um, just a bit of networking and, and just being involved with people other than uh, more chiropractors. Thank you very much. Thank you.